What up, what up, what up, what up, what up? Your boy, the pompous puller. So July 8th. Got that right-handed super match with Van Dragos. I got a lot to prove. After uh, East vs. West qualifier. Overmatched. Very disappointing performance out in Fort Wayne. Cobra Classic was sick, though. Cobra Classic was sweet. Uh, great experience. Anyway, uh, and then, of course, the uh, most recent both arms for the uh, number 10 spot right-handed in Illinois. Disappointing. That dude was uh, he was too much for me. He got me on the go. Uh, just battled too much in the setup. Hand fighting. Couldn't set a hook. Gave up on setting the hook. Uh, but, you know, losses make you better. And I definitely am smarter. I feel like my table IQ and technique are a lot better since then. Uh, I'm ready July 8th. I'm going to keep training. I mean, I got, I got time left to train. It's not shut down or anything. Weight's on point. I'm going to be ready for the right-handed super match for sure and ready for the left-handed round robin. I'm going to step to the table, as I always do, bring a lot of energy, put on a show. I'm going to try and really get rid of the anxiety and the, uh, the rush with the show before I step to the table. When I step to the table, try and stay like an organized chaos. Calm, cool, and collected. And then explode on the go. I'm going to lock in. Focus. You know, stay mentally strong. Watch the ref's mouth. Focus on that. Focus on the go. Positioning. From my head to my toe, lock in all the little things. Then after this is over, I'm not going to compete again until January 2024. It's all training. It's all getting stronger, better technique-wise. The whole focus is 2024 for the pompous puller, starting with Illinois State. I went through a time uh, where I was thinking I was just going to pull pros at Illinois State this year. I felt like I had nothing left for the pros after I went through the amateurs and then into the pros. That plan has now changed. I'm doing the same thing that I did last year at Illinois State. I'm pulling both arms and I'm pulling pros and ams. Experience, stamina, and it's a good judge of my progression. Let's see how I feel. If I've got anything left at the end, my stamina is much better. Because I had nothing left at the end for the pros. Second place right-handed amateurs, Illinois State last year. I mean, clearly... To show improvement there, I got to win that. So that's the goal. Right-handed amateur champ at Illinois State 2024. See how I do left-handed. See how I do in the pros. See how I feel when it's all said and done. Progression. You know? I've said it a bunch of times. Two steps forward for every one step back. I said I was coming for John's soul and his money. He took my money. He took my soul. He got the W. He held on to his ranking. Congratulations to him. I'll see you again. After Illinois State, I'll take a good hard looking look at the rankings. I'll see where we're at. See where I'm at. Then it's time to crack the rankings. Super stoked for tomorrow. 
photo shoot for an upcoming league. The Undisputed Arm Wrestling Challenge. If you haven't already, like that page. Subscribe to the Pompous Puller. Like the River City Arm Wrestling Facebook page and join the group. Subscribe to my boy, Clayton. Too humble to brag. Clayton Bragg's YouTube channel. Ton of good stuff on there. River City Arm Wrestling. Arm Wrestling. Get involved today. Ah. Uh.